Hello, it's Paul here. I'm just going to take you through the new production shot process in Stop Motion Pro, which has been introduced for version 7 to make organising and finding your films easier. Alright, when you start up a new production shot in Stop Motion Pro, I can give a, a name to this one, I'll call it Internet Animation, and underneath that I can put different shots. So if I'm making a range of shots, I can uh, keep them grouped together. So I'll call this uh, Shot 1. Click OK. The uh, capture settings window opens. My video camera opens. And I can start filming my animation like that. All right. I'll close that production shot. Now, let's say I want to uh, create another shot in that series. I would go File, New Production Shot, and from the drop down, I can see here I've got Internet Animation. And I want to film Shot 2. Click OK. Click OK to my capture type, and here's Shot 2. I'll zoom right in. Okay, so I'll film my little piece of animation there. Now, I want to start a new production because I'm making a sh some films for YouTube. So I might group these all under the name YouTube. And my shot will be a test walk. Click OK. And I just go ahead and film my animation. So I finished my animation and let's say now I want to go back and have a look at some animation I filmed earlier. Down here at the bottom of the file menu I can see a list of the production and shots that I filmed recently. Another way I can find my productions and shots is by clicking on the Open Production and Shots. This then opens a window like this. It's actually showing all my shots. However, I can come in and select the Production drop-down and just choose to look at the animation for the Internet Animation Production. And there's my two shots that I filmed there. Or I might just want to look at my YouTube animations and I can see them here. This is a great way to group your animations together so you can find them easier later. Another handy feature in this window is the ability to play back your clips. So you click on them, press play, and you can see them. So you get an instant preview of the animation in that shot. It's also possible to do things like copy the shot. So the shot I've got selected here in red, give it a new name, click OK. Shot 2, edit. I could move it into a different production if I wanted as well. Great. Well, that concludes this demonstration on the new production shot name process in Stop Motion Pro version 7.